court. What I find most interesting, though, is Johnny Depp did not just defend the motion that he brought in L2. He filed a counterclaim, and so trying to say that that $2 million verdict against him really shouldn't be. Amber's fatal mistake. A loophole has enabled Johnny to apply immense pressure on her appeal. Johnny is not backing down in this heated legal battle against Amber and plans on making her pay for a huge blunder that she's committed, allowing Johnny to exploit it and leveraging another win. The clock for Amber has run down and it's now time for her to pay Johnny Depp the money she owes him. But where will she bring this money from? Will she lose her appeal if she can't pay Johnny the damages? Keep watching to find out. An interesting thread on Twitter has given us an insight into the situation developing in the appeals of both Johnny and Amber. A user wrote, I guess AH failed to post her appeal bond today. The deadline, which means Johnny Depp can start collecting his money today. Go get her, tiger. A person replied to this tweet saying, can you honestly see him going for it though? When I watched the trial, I didn't get the impression he gave a fiddlers about the money. The person with the original tweet responded to this, adding, It's about applying pressure. War is about fighting on multiple fronts. So this is what it all boils down to at the end of the day. Even though Depp, through his attorneys, has made it clear that the trial was never about money for him, and for a person with a net worth of over $150 million, $10 million more won't make much of a difference to him. So he is right. But that doesn't mean that he stops fighting to defend his rights and to restore his tarnished image. In order to do that, he needs needs to be aggressive against Amber and take the fight to her by not allowing her to undo all the hard work Johnny and his team had to do to win the case in the first place. When the case was over, Amber's lawyer seemed very cocky and confident about an appeal, saying, Your client wants to appeal. Oh, absolutely. And she has some excellent grounds for it. We even had tried to get the UK judgment in to dismiss his case because he already had his shot. Um, and that's one of the issues, but also a number of the evidentiary issues. There was so much. Little did Amber and her team know that in order to file an appeal, she would have just a month to file a suspension bond worth over $8 million to stop Johnny from collecting on his payment. Payments. This is what happened when Amber's team tried to push back on the bond. And uh, Judge Ascarati basically said, well, you can address whatever you want, but you have to file the bond. And that bond would be the $8.35 million plus 6% interest per year. And the judge basically made no bones about it. If you want to appeal, you have to file that money in order. This happened on June 24th, and it's now been way beyond the one-month deadline in which Amber had to post the $8 million bond. This is what the tweet earlier was referring to, and it now means that Johnny can officially force Amber to pay him the money that he is owed. What will this do is destroy Amber financially to the point where she would no longer be able to afford to fight her case anymore and would have to withdraw her appeal. Johnny has been relieved and content after winning his case against Amber last month, as is evident from this statement by his lawyers. Action in the moment. I think just an overwhelming sense of relief. I was speaking with another friend of our mutual friend of Johnny's and ours, and he said, I haven't seen Johnny smile like that in six years. The, the weight of the world is off his shoulders. He's and got his life back. Since Johnny has achieved what he originally set out to do when he sued Amber a few years ago, whether he actually goes ahead with collecting his payment is anyone's guess. But he is playing hardball right now to apply pressure on Amber and see where things lead. Johnny will do anything to show the world that he deserves justice. But if he is pushed to end Amber Heard, he has all the legal power to do so. That's it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye.